RAHOB alum Brandy Glanville admits that she went too far with this cosmetic trend. Welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. Over the years, fans have questioned what has happened to her face. They have noted how beautiful she once was and now she is finally dishing on what she has done. Keep reading for all of the details. It has been a rough year for Brandy Glanville, especially with the RHUGT Morocco controversy. She wants the show to air so she can be vindicated and viewers can see that she did nothing wrong. At this point, with the lawsuits and how she has threatened Bravo, it likely won't happen. However, all of the stress that has gone along with the controversy has affected Brandy's health. She shared that she has stress-induced angiotema, which made her face swell. Therefore, she could not talk properly, and it did impact her ability to do her podcast. It did not help that she has had some work done, and it diminished some of her natural beauty. Now, she has opened up about the work she had done to her face, some that she regrets. According to Page Six, Brandy wishes she never got cheek fillers. Looking back, Brandy has a hard time seeing photos of when she did that to herself. At the same time, Brandy Glanville has not stopped indulging in other facial treatments that she enjoys. She partakes in Botox and things of that nature. This is the extent of what the mother of two sons will do. She shares that she does not heal fast, so she will not go under the knife for anything. Maintenance is key. Right now, Brandy Glanville admits that maintenance is key, but she knows not to go too far ever again. Furthermore, she has taken note of what non-invasive treatments work for her and what she will stay away from. She is feeling much better than she was earlier in the year. Her podcast has returned, and she attending a rejuvenation event with some of her RHUGT2 co-stars. So things are looking up for the former Bravolib. Do you agree that Brandy had gone too far with some facial procedures and should have left well enough alone? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. Brandy Glanville, former star of The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills, was no stranger to the pressures of maintaining her appearance in the unforgiving world of reality television. Known for her candid personality and unfiltered opinions, Brandy had always been open about her cosmetic procedures. However, as she entered her mid-forties, she began to feel the weight of maintaining her youthful looks more acutely than ever. It all started innocently enough, a few Botox injections here, a little filler there. But as Brandy scrolled through social media, she couldn't help but notice the increasingly perfect faces staring back at her. Smooth, wrinkle-free skin, plump lips, and high cheekbones seemed to be the new standard of beauty, and Brandy felt the pressure to keep up. One day, while visiting her favorite aesthetic clinic, she overheard a conversation about the latest cosmetic trend, PDO thread lifts. The procedure promised a non-surgical facelift, using dissolvable threads to lift and tighten the skin. In treat, Brandy scheduled a consultation to learn more. Brandy's consultation with Dr. Leela Andrews, a renowned cosmetic surgeon in Beverly Hills, was thorough. Dr. Andrews explained the procedure in detail, emphasizing the benefits and potential risks. The PDO thread lift is minimally invasive and can provide a more youthful appearance by lifting sagging skin and stimulating collagen production, Dr. Andrews said, showing Brandy before and after photos of previous patients. However, it's important to remember that every procedure carries some risk and results can vary. Brandy examined the photos, impressed by the dramatic transformations. She felt a rush of excitement mixed with a hint of anxiety. How long does the procedure take, and what's the recovery like, she asked. The procedure typically takes about an hour, and recovery time is minimal. You might experience some swelling and bruising, but it should subside within a few days, Dr. Andrews replied. Brandy nodded, feeling more confident. Let's do it, I want to look my best. On the day of the procedure, Brandy arrived at the clinic feeling a mix of anticipation and nerves. 
The staff was friendly and professional, putting her at ease. She was led to a treatment room, where Dr. Andrews greeted her warmly. Are you ready, Brandy? Dr. Andrews asked, preparing the equipment. Ready as I'll ever be, Brandy replied with a nervous laugh. The procedure began with a local anesthetic to numb the areas where the threads would be inserted. Brandy felt a slight tugging sensation as the threads were carefully placed under her skin. Despite the discomfort, she remained calm, trusting Dr. Andrew's expertise. After about an hour, the procedure was complete. Brandy looked in the mirror, pleased with the immediate results. Her skin appeared lifted and tighter, giving her a refreshed, youthful look. Thank you, Dr. Andrews. It looks amazing, Brandy said, smiling. You're welcome, Brandy. Remember to follow the aftercare instructions, and you'll see even better results in the coming weeks, Dr. Andrews advised. In the days following the procedure, Brandy was thrilled with her new look. The swelling and bruising were minimal, and she felt more confident than ever. She eagerly shared her experience with her followers on social media, posting selfies and updates about her recovery. However, as the weeks went by, Brandy began to notice some unexpected changes. Her skin felt tighter, almost too tight, and she experienced occasional discomfort. She dismissed it at first, attributing it to the healing process. But when the tightness turned into persistent pain, she knew something was wrong. Concerned, Brandy scheduled a follow-up appointment with Dr. Andrews. During the examination, Dr. Andrews looked concerned. Brandy, it appears that some of the threads may have migrated, causing the discomfort you're experiencing. We might need to adjust or remove them. Brandy felt a wave of anxiety. What does that mean? Will it fix the problem? Dr. Andrews nodded reassuringly. Yes, we can correct it. I'll remove the problematic threads, and we'll discuss other options for achieving your desired results. The thread removal procedure was quick but left Brandy feeling deflated. She had hoped for a perfect, pain-free result, and the setback was disheartening. Determined to find a solution, Brandy began researching other cosmetic options and consulting with different specialists. One evening, as she scrolled through her phone, she came across a video of a renowned dermatologist, Dr. Alina Martinez, discussing the importance of a balanced approach to cosmetic procedures. Intrigued by Dr. Martinez's philosophy of enhancing natural beauty rather than chasing perfection, Brandy decided to schedule a consultation. At her appointment, Dr. Martinez greeted Brandy with a warm smile. Brandy, it's a pleasure to meet you. Let's discuss your concerns and find a way to achieve your goals without compromising your comfort. Brandy explained her experience with the PDO thread lift and her desire to maintain a youthful appearance. Dr. Martinez listened attentively, then offered her advice. Brandy, I believe in a holistic approach to beauty. Instead of relying solely on invasive procedures, we can combine minimally invasive treatments with a healthy lifestyle and proper skincare. This will enhance your natural beauty and provide long-lasting results. Brandy felt a sense of relief. That sounds exactly like what I need. What treatments do you recommend? Dr. Martinez suggested a combination of microneedling, laser therapy, and a customized skincare regimen. These treatments will stimulate collagen production, improve skin texture, and give you a radiant, youthful glow without the risks associated with more invasive procedures. Over the next few months, Brandy followed Dr. Martinez's recommendations. She underwent a series of microneedling sessions and laser treatments, gradually noticing a significant improvement in her skin's texture and appearance. The discomfort she had experienced from the PDO threads began to fade, replaced by a newfound confidence in her natural beauty. Brandy also embraced a healthier lifestyle, incorporating regular exercise, a balanced diet, and mindfulness practices into her routine. She noticed that her overall well-being improved, reflecting positively on her appearance. As she shared her journey on social media, her followers responded with overwhelming support. 
They appreciated her honesty and vulnerability, and many were inspired by her decision to prioritize her health and natural beauty over extreme cosmetic procedures. One evening, as Brandy prepared for a red carpet event, she looked in the mirror and smiled. Her skin was glowing, and she felt more confident than she had in years. She knew she had made the right decision to step back from the cosmetic trend that had caused her so much distress. At the event, Brandy mingled with fellow celebrities and media personalities. She received numerous compliments on her appearance, but what stood out most was the appreciation for her authenticity. People admired her for being real and open about her experiences. During an interview with a popular entertainment news outlet, Brandy was asked about her recent transformation and the lessons she had learned. I realized that chasing perfection can be a dangerous game, Brandy said. It's easy to get caught up in the pressure to look a certain way, especially in this industry. But I've learned that true beauty comes from embracing who you are and taking care of yourself in a holistic way.